And when you think about Strata, what makes it such a beautiful race for you? I think, uh, yeah, it's a special race because of the, the, the sand, actually, the, the gravel roads, uh, which are quite special, the, the scenery of Tuscany. Uh, the dust uh, and the special finish in Siena himself. I think it's something iconic already. Also, it's not a really a race that existed already quite long, but it feels directly the first time when I came here, it's, it's capable to be a big classic. And I think it also proved already over the, the years that we did it, that uh, it's something special and it's a race that I really like. And what makes it such a hard race to win? Oh, I think the parkour is super hard. Uh, you have 3,000 altitude meters over only 180k. And this together with uh, roads that are not rolling well, the risk a little bit, uh, the technique you need, and steep hills. Uh, I think uh, this all together makes it really hard to win. Uh, and that's also why I think uh, all the winners that won it that are just probably always the strongest of the race. Yeah, I, I think yeah, the most important is having good shape, good legs, good material, uh, being well prepared, uh, coming here. Uh, and then you need just a little bit of luck and uh, it's also a parkour that fits me really well. And I think also because of this I'm quite stable in my results over here and that's also why I did so many top tennis finishes and uh, it's also a race I really like so motivation is super important. And when you look at this year's edition, and obviously we're talking about a totally different race in August rather than March. What do you... You keep asking. Yeah, exactly. And what for you is going to be more difficult? Do you think the fact that you haven't raced for four months or the heat? I think, uh, yeah, it's, it's strange because it's, of course, normally you have a preparation races before and you can, uh, you can see your shape a little bit compared to the others. Now it's out of the blue, you come where you think you're well prepared. Uh, also the, the circumstances are different, like heat. Also I did the recon today and it's, it's a bit of a different uh, gravel, I think. It's more uh, stony, uh, more stony addition than in when it's in March because you had a couple of race, race days before. Now it's really dry. So this kind of circumstances will make it uh, more technical, I think, and more dangerous. Uh, everybody's super nervous also because it's the first race, everybody wants to prove himself. So this kind of things, I think it will be a hectic uh, Strade Bianche uh, for this year. Mm -hmm. And now you're heading into that first race, what is the sensation? Is it nervousness, excitement? Oh, uh, it's a bit strange, yeah? it's a strange situation to be here in July, it's a totally different feeling. Uh, stressed for the moment, not yet, but I think it will come for sure uh, on the race day himself. Uh, but I want, just want to prove myself that I was training well and uh, that I'm ready for the first race. I think everybody has this in mind, you know, you're no warming up, just go directly when it's really important. Something we're maybe not used to in, in our sport, but uh, I think I'm well prepared and I'm, I'm looking actually forward to be back in the bunch.